uh, all right so the next thing uh, next uh, interesting ex extension that i want to share with you guys is the nod reactions for google meet well it is not so technical but uh, it is quite really helpful when you uh, when you are conducting a lecture online and you do not want interruptions from the students like if they want to ask a question or they want to have a query or they have an answer for your question or whatever type of disturbance sometimes uh, while conducting online sessions these uh, disturbances uh, create a lot of uh, nuisance during the uh, session so that's why and uh, not for google meet not reactions these are basically uh, some quick emoji reactions like just uh, we have in facebook so uh, i wanted to show you then so i have added that extension here it's showing the thumbs up uh, extension showing the not reactions and uh, i'm in a, i've created the meeting i'm in the meeting and uh, on the left side left corner side you can see the reactions available the through which the students can reply all right so when you are teaching so there will be no disturbance and uh, you will be notified by if a student wants to ask something or if a student is happy with the session or or if he is unhappy or he has a query or whatever so let's say if someone wants to ask a query he can raise his hand and see you can see uh, the teacher can see sheetal raised her their hand so that means uh, she wants to ask some question or let's say if someone somebody else wants to clap for the lecture like uh, that was an amazing so it is showing a clap clap uh, sign for the session all right uh, now since you see the raise a hand session will be there until unless you click on that because that signifies that a student is having a question all right so similarly there are several reactions and uh, you can if you want to scold them a little bit if they are creating a nuisance <laughs> you can show them this sign all right so that's that adds a much uh, that adds a little fun element to the class otherwise uh, it is purely your uh, choice to use it or not so some people don't like to use these kind of stuff in the sessions they find it distractive so it is purely your choice you uh, you can wish to skip this uh, extension for your google meet so that's it about uh, the extensions for google meet all the extensions that can be possibly used in google meet we have mentioned here now i'm going to in the next videos i'm going to uh, talk about uh, the most general uh, uh, extensions that can be used for improving teaching and learning all right so let's see in the next video